What's up, YouTube? This your boy Melvin. Take one, two. We're coming at you with lucky number seven. Lucky number seven. Lucky number seven episode of The Real Husbands of Hollywood. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you share it on Facebook. Make sure you share it on Twitter. Tum, 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 Follow me on Twitter at Melvin. Take one. Let's get into the episode. First off, this episode starts off with JB being the man. This episode is really focused a lot on JB. Um, he's starting his new show called Trick. I don't know why, but if, all through this episode, I just I just kept hearing that song ahead. I hit that trick cup side head with a bottle. I hit that trick upside head with a bottle. I just keep hearing that. Oh, hold up. Hold up. Got a long going. I got to run out the video. Sorry about that. That was real get over. Guess what? I don't feel like stopping the video and guess what? Hey, it don't really matter. You man be hey. I hit that chick upside head with a bottle. Okay, let's get on to the video. Um, like I said, the video is really centered around JB. He's got this show where he tricks celebrities. But the only thing about it, it's a real ghetto version because he tricks celebrities, but he can't really afford to really, you know, do what he's going to do. Okay, so anyways, um, Kim goes to his attorney's office. He finds out that he got some chick two months pregnant. All right. First of all, he's like, yeah, that could be anybody. Second of all, the sex tape is like, all right, all right, all right. This sex tape is the funniest sex tape I've ever seen. This sex tape probably is so probably like maybe five, six, copies if that um and that's even if it's not free uh, it's rich real fun so Kevin dealing with this chick saying she's too much pregnant you got phase on love who's mad because um JB don't mess up his car you know he just he he got him on that show trick you know I hit that chick upside the head with a bottle I just gotta sit there attack that just that's just that's just too freaking funny to me so phase on love goes to this goes to this anger man anger therapist will be some anger therapist he's an actual Asian anger therapist I think I don't never heard of an Asian anger th therapist. So then he starts shocking, shocking Faisal Love. Ah, sure he's gonna love. Oh God, God, God. So finally Faisal Love he's a big bigger than guy. He just thinks he starts shock, shocking Asian guy. He's like, oh, oh, do me, do me, do me. Then that's when Faisal Love, okay, like you like this, okay, I gotta leave. I agree with him on that. So Kevin goes down to the bank. He's trying to find out from the stripper. And the stripper's too much pregnant. All of a sudden, it gets an argument. Then two bank robbers come to the bank. Kevin, mind, mind you, Kevin knows that JB's trying to kind of get him on the trick on the trick show. You know, I hit that chick upside the head with a bottle. So Kevin thinks that the robbers coming in. Oh, this is JB. So all of a sudden, he's like, Oh, I got twenty thousand dollars. Take me not these people. He's like, Oh, Kevin Jordan. Next thing you know, Kevin Hart is butt naked in front of the dog, butt naked in the bank. Bang. All of a sudden, after 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 after, after he comes out the bank, he's butt naked. This police officer comes out there. Comes out there, grab him, arrest him, and take him to some kind of beach. I don't know where the beach is, somewhere, but he has the police uniform on. And he, go, he goes back to me and the chick. You know, why you didn't tell me about it too much pregnant? What we gonna do? What we gonna do? All of a sudden, JB comes out with a van and said that Kevin Hart's been tricked. Been tricked. You know, on that show, I hit that chick upside the head with a bottle. So all of a sudden, he's been tricked. And Kevin's like, oh, okay, so the bank robbers was all that with my money. And JB Smooth like, no, nah, no, nah, the bank was some real stuff. You just gave your money, lost your thing. So Kevin's like, oh, okay, wait a minute, cut off the camera. Mind you, face on love, done stole the truck, which is tricked, which I don't know why they never said that, said, 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 said that they never discussed JB being tricked in the show because he was tricked by face on love, face on lust. So the man, so all of a sudden, this was the pivotal different episode. Every episode we saw used to Kevin Hart getting knocked out. But for once, the little dude did something right. He knocked JB out. And guess what? That's the way the story is. You know, it was I hit that chick upside the head with a bottle. So Kevin Hart finally knocked somebody out. So that's the way pretty much the episode ends. And I'm just going to end it with a quick little prayer. Father God, in the name of Jesus, oh, score one for the big, score one for the little guy, Lord. Kevin Hart, finally knock somebody out, Lord. Lord, why Jay Smooth had to try to trick my man. Lord, Kevin, watch with them robbers, because they had your butt naked in front of a doggone bank. Oh, Lord, watch out for the strippers, Lord, and make sure Kevin don't, make sure don't nobody find that sex tape, Lord, because that sex tape, Lord, was the worst sex tape I've ever seen, Lord. I don't know what was going on. Mm-hmm. Kevin Hart, you don't never need to do no dog on sex tape again. Ooh, that was sad. Oh, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you for JB. I hope he get his show straight. Oh, Lord. Clay B, don't hit that chick upside head with no bottle. Oh, Lord. These blessed nice names, name, Jesus Christ. Amen. Love you guys. Bye.